everyone. Welcome to Southern Sassy. And boy, do we have a great show today, right? We are going to solve a mystery. We get yeah. asked all the time if we're sisters, and we're not related, but... But we might be. Just in case, we have sent off our DNA, and we are going to talk about and reveal mm -hmm. what it says. I don't know hers, and she doesn't know mine. Nope. And it's going to be very interesting to see. We might really be sisters. We could be. That'd be so awesome. Who's your dad? <laughs> I don't know, but it might be your dad. <laughs> All right. Stay, stay with us as we reveal our DNA today on Southern <laughs> Sassy. If you could live anywhere, where would it be? What would it be like? With today's home values, this is the perfect time to sell and make those dreams a reality. At ColdwellBanker.com, you can get an instant estimate on your home. Your dreams don't have to be just dreams. At Coldwell Banker Canal Realty, we've been serving our community since 1974 with offices in Dalton, Calhoun, Ringgold, Cardsville, and Cleveland, Tennessee. We've got you covered. Hi, I'm Mitch Sanford with Biltwell Bank. Yes, that's right. First Bank of Dalton is now Biltwell Bank. What does that mean for you? It means the same exceptional service from the bankers you know and trust. It means a larger footprint that expands through 13 counties in Georgia and Tennessee. It means your community bank is still right around the corner. Want to learn more? Visit us at Biltwell.Bank or give us a call at 706-226-5377. Well-built communities start with well-built banks. Did you know skin cancer is the most common cancer in the United States with over 5 million cases diagnosed each year, yet it is one of the most preventable? Hi, I'm Courtney Johnston, the physician assistant at Dalton Plastic Surgery. Did you know we offer routine skin checks in our office? Schedule your appointment with us if you have any areas of concern or if you have not had a recent skin exam. At Dalton Plastic Surgery, we offer an array of different services to help you feel and look your very best. Give us a call today. Welcome to Carpets and Furniture of Dalton. Our 250,000 square foot showroom is filled with every kind of indoor and outdoor furniture imaginable, ready to take home today, along with a huge selection of custom cabinets, appliances, lighting, and accessories. Need flooring? We have that too. Shop our massive selection of in-stock carpet, hardwood, LVT, ceramic tile, and area rugs. Take advantage of our free design consultation to make your home look its best. Visit us today at Carpets and Furniture of Dalton. Your destination for home. <laughs> Welcome back to Southern Sassy. And, well, I don't even know where to start with this, but we're going to be talking about uh, DNAs mm -hmm. and um, ancestry and, yeah. and, and kin folks, as we call it where I'm from, and yeah. your relatives and yeah. your relations. And uh, So, Jay Marie did a DNA mm -hmm. um, back a couple of months ago, mm -hmm. and actually, uh, we have her take a look at this. She's getting ready to do her, send off her DNA, right? So mm -hmm. there you are. Okay. Got it. Got it. <laughs> okay. All right. So she sent the DNA off a couple of months ago. Mm -hmm. It took a couple of months. Yeah. Too, well, it? they lost it. And then oh, they, they just sent said me they did. Well, yeah. 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 Or either they just didn't want to tell me. I don't know. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so I had to redo it. But it finally came back last week. So we're going to do a real reveal. reveal. But Judy did hers a couple of years ago. I did mine a couple of years ago. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and, and I failed it. Yeah, mm -hmm. and Brandon did his. But what I didn't know is when Brandon was saying they have updated his, and I didn't realize that they did that as they get more information. Really? Like they, because he was saying he was so much of this and so much of this, but now it's kind of changed a little bit different. So that that was kind of good to know. You know, well, I haven't I haven't had mine changed, and I had mine done in 2018, and I haven't been notified. Well, maybe so your yours didn't maybe, change. Maybe any. it didn't. Yeah. He's a mix, though. He's a big mix. Yeah, he's, he's got a bunch of different pieces and parts, I know. <laughs> I thought mine just come back 100% white girl, but it did. I mean, it didn't. So uh -huh. it'll, it'll be a, be kind of neat. So I'm curious to see what yours are. Why did you wind up doing it anyway? 
I don't know. I think I just wanted to know, like, where my ancestors, like, what I have more of a mix, I guess. I don't know. Really, I just wanted to do it. I didn't have a reason. A lot of people will do it, though, for pater uh, paternal reasons. Yeah. See, find lost siblings and stuff, or maybe yeah. find out about siblings. Yeah. Or and then, what? you know, what else I read? That people sometimes um, need to do it because maybe of um, um, uh, uh, inheritance. Oh, to see if they're really related. Yeah. Oh. Because someone may come in the family and say, hey, 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 I'm, I'm related here. I'm, I'm the, you know, fourth, fifth cousin removed, whatever, and I'm part of this estate. Yeah. And oh. so they may have to do a DNA to reveal, really, did they, were they part of this? Interesting. Yeah, I thought that was very interesting. Now, we, I DNA'd my dog. Do have you ever, yeah. did you know you could do pets? Uh, yeah, I read that. Yeah, we DNA'd the dog. Uh, we had adopted her from the Humane Society, and she was a lot golden retriever, or they said she was golden retriever, but we've had golden retrievers a lot, so I'm like, well, she has a lot of the traits, but, so we just kind of sent off the DNA thing on her, and she was 50% golden retriever, but then really? she had two other things, so. Really? Yeah, so it was never, interesting. Did you know plants, every living thing has DNA? Mm -hmm. I did not know that. I know, it's now, like I know. a thumbprint. Everybody's are different. Now, I know you you have a big chemistry background because of pharmaceutical. Right. You've been a pharmacist, right? Right. right. So, what does DNA, because you, you told me a little earlier, like, I don't remember it, but what is the actual term that it stands for, or what is DNA? If I tell you, then you're gonna to have to spell it. Well, what is DNA? Deoxyribonucleic acid. Okay, what does that mean? That just, that DNA is just the shorthand version for it. Okay. It's just the double helix strand that it, everybody has DNA. It's your four amino acids. They all work together in combination. A lot of it's similar, but there's so many other options. There's millions of options that no two are the same. Okay. But some of your alleles can line up and you can be related, like a 99.9% .9 chance that we're sisters. Or, you know, you can rule out a lot of people, but ruling people in as far as a relative is uh -huh. a little different. You know, when I, when I got mine back, it said also, would you like to contact people that, are, that could be related? And I said, no. Really? Just let it go. No, I, I, I didn't care about it. Really? I should have. Should not. Yeah, that would have been kind of neat. Yeah. I think you said You could have contacted me. I think it might have said Jane Marie. I'm like, no, I don't want her to know that. No. I'm just teasing about that. But really, it did. It's like, do you want to be connected with more people that, that could be related to really? you? Like, yeah, I thought that was very interesting. But I didn't do that. Well, see, I didn't know if that was going to be true or not. Because what if you contacted somebody and they're not really and you're just, yeah. you know, I just didn't want well, to get involved so with that. There's different kinds, and I don't know all the differences in them. You know, all these different brands and all these different, you know, yeah. things. So I don't know if one does... You know, mm. I don't know. I, I don't know, but I, I, I read 99% of the DNA is all alike, except there's 1% that makes the difference. Right. I did not know that. Yep. yep. Interesting. But I think DNAs are very interesting to do. Mm -hmm. um, and I want to know what you are when we come back. When are you going to reveal this on the show? Oh, whatever you want. Okay. okay, we can talk about yours and then I'll show you mine and we'll see if we're sisters. Well, okay, well, oh yeah, I got an idea about that. Okay. All right, so we'll be right back on Southern Sassy. Eddie, you know, car sales have really changed over the last couple of years. Yeah, they have, Greg, but we're still getting the car that you want. If you're patient, you're willing to come in and give us a little bit of time, we're filling every order. And we still want your used cars. Go to NorthGeorgiaToyota.com to check your value. Greg, other dealers are going to say, we can't do that. What do we say? Oh, yes, they can. Hey, that's my part. <laughs> Only at North Georgia Toyota in Dalton. Come see us. Did you know skin cancer is the most common cancer in the United States with over 5 million cases diagnosed each year, yet it is one of the most preventable? Hi, I'm Courtney Johnston, the physician assistant at Dalton Plastic Surgery. Did you know we offer routine skin checks in our office? Schedule your appointment with us if you have any areas of concern or if you have not had a recent skin exam. At Dalton Plastic Surgery, we offer an array of different services to help you feel and look your very best. Give us a call today. 
Hi, I'm Mitch Sanford with Biltwell Bank. Yes, that's right. First Bank of Dalton is now Biltwell Bank. What does that mean for you? It means the same exceptional service from the bankers you know and trust. It means a larger footprint that expands through 13 counties in Georgia and Tennessee. It means your community bank is still right around the corner. Want to learn more? Visit us at Biltwell.Bank or give us a call at 706-226-5377. Well-built communities start with well-built banks. Welcome to Carpets and Furniture of Dalton. Our 250,000 square foot showroom is filled with every kind of indoor and outdoor furniture imaginable, ready to take home today, along with a huge selection of custom cabinets, appliances, lighting, and accessories. Need flooring? We have that too. Shop our massive selection of in-stock carpet, hardwood, LVT, ceramic tile, and area rugs. Take advantage of our free design consultation to make your home look its best. Visit us today at Carpets and Furniture of Dalton. Your destination for home. Hey, we're back with you here on Southern Sassy. We are talking about DNAs, DNA results. Yes. DNA reasons why people have. But one thing we missed on that first segment, some people like to know what their DNA is for health reasons. Yeah. Yeah. A friend of mine was actually adopted and, you know, yeah. didn't know. And he was in great shape. He was a Marine. He flew helicopters, ate great and everything. And at 30, he had a quadruple bypass. Wow. Yeah. And I mean, he was healthy and he ate all the natural stuff. This was way back before all the natural <laughs> stuff, you know, yeah, exactly. was readily available. So, and it was crazy. So he finally did a DNA because he, you know, he was adopted. He didn't know his, I guess, medical history. Right. And it came back that he, it was just genetically high cholesterol. He was really? prone to heart attacks. And he had another one since, you know, so between 30 and 35. It wow. Was, yeah. That's interesting. Very interesting. Well, I do have my results and I'm going to talk about those. But first, let me talk about <laughs> let me talk about Brandon Browns because Brandon said <laughs> Brandon's here with us and he knew we were talking about this. So he And tell me who Brandon it. is, because I don't know who Brandon is. Brandon Brandon is the one that makes this show fantastic, you know. <laughs> Brandon Brown. You know, Brandon Brown. You always know Brandon Brown, right? Okay. Brandon Brown's a standard a beautiful name around town. <laughs> <laughs> he's over there laughing. But anyway, he's the one that does all their shows. Okay, so uh, Brandon shared this with me. He didn't know exactly I was going to share this. Look, 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 look at Brandon's. One, two, three, four. He's a five mix. Five mix. He's a Heinz 57. Heinz, uh, a yeah. mutt. <laughs> England and Northwestern Europe is 41%. Scotland is 36%. I've never seen him wear a kilt, though. No. I wonder, hey, maybe he should wear a dress when we do the next show. <laughs> Ireland's 13%. Wales, Wales is 6%. Sweden and Denmark is 4%. I've never seen anybody that mixed up. <laughs> <laughs> Have you? I, I've never seen anybody's Sorry, DNA Brandon. results. That's the first I mean, time I I've seen anybody. I, I, just never, I didn't know he had such a mix. That's kind of cool, though. He don't look mixed up, does he? <laughs> <laughs> He looks, he looks normal. <laughs> but anyway, that's pretty cool. Now, yeah. now, oh, have you, so I, I take it you don't have that many. Well, let me just show you mine. All right. Well, his is a family tree on there. See, I didn't get a family tree or anything. I didn't, I Did didn't you get, get a family no, tree. No, I didn't want to know anymore. Oh, that's right. That's what I'm saying. I only want I to know. I have that option. I don't think I like my company. I may have to redo it. Which All right. I, this is I my DNA. Company. All right. Okay. Great. Here you go. Is that yours? Yes. Oh, okay. okay. All right. My DNA, guess, I'm just going to let you guess. Swedish. Nope. Norwegian. No. Oh. Because she got blonde hair and polar bear. <laughs> Spanish. Spanish? <laughs> I'm just teasing. Keep guessing. You haven't guessed it yet. Uh, German. No. Europe. European and Asian. Some European, yeah. Okay. Get this. 66% Northwestern Europe, England, okay. and Wales. Oh, I, I felt you might that. be Brandon's sister. What, what was he? <laughs> he's, he? He's Wales. Maybe I am Brandon's sister. There you sister. go. <laughs> All right. So, you know what? Here's the strange thing. Before this even came back, I felt that. I felt I was, no joke, I felt I was from England. Uh-huh. Why were you trying to talk like the, the uh, English people? No, I just, I just felt that. I just because here's the thing: um, 
when I would decorate, this is a couple years ago, but I would always go toward that English style, European mm -hmm. style. Is that not crazy? No. Oh. And I really, I did. And so I was like, I wonder if I've got that in my blood line. Huh. So, and 66% England, England, Wales, and Northwestern Europe. Now okay. you sound like you got a speech impediment. <laughs> if you're trying to be English, you're not doing a very good job. All right, guess what else is, guess what else I'm a mix? Well, I said Europe and I said Asia. Is that not right? But I got the Europe right. Ireland and Scotland. Again, you're Brand Brand you may be Brandon's sister. I'm Ireland and Scotland. Right, I'm 30, I'm 34, um, 34% Ireland and Scottish. He's 36. Yeah. But then you add that 13 with it. Seven, six, nah, he's 49 and I'm 34. Yeah, Brandon, we could be related. Y'all might, be, <laughs> might be related. <laughs> hey, and my immigrants, guess where they're from? Where they came from? Your immigrants. Yeah. I mean, migra migration. You, what? <laughs> Okay, all right. Migration. I, I'm confused. Well, Western North Carolina settlers. That's where they. That's where they settled. Oh, so when they came home, mm -hmm. came home, yeah, came, came, over, yeah. came back from, came yeah. back from Europe yeah. and settled in North Carolina. Yeah. Oh, that's. And so interesting that I married a guy from North Carolina. Dang, now I wish. I wonder if he was my cousin. <laughs> uh, I'm oh sure. Oh my goodness! You know, I need to go home and tell him that. Has he done his? No, <gasps> he don't want to. Wow. Because he knows she's my cousin. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's okay. I didn't, I didn't know it. Now we know why you didn't have children. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah okay. Well, that's it. My gosh, I can't believe it. We are that. revealing way I, too many mysteries on this show. I'm just telling y'all. I hope he doesn't watch this show. Oh, my gosh. Oh, <laughs> that's not, pretty funny. I did not know this, seriously, until just that's now that I, I didn't reach past that. My oh, gosh, that North is Carolina. Funny. I really didn't know that. Huh. Now, if, England, Wales, if and Northwest Alabama, Europe. I might have thought that, but not from Western North Carolina. How well, about that's that? where the hillbillies are up there in the, the valleys and stuff, and they don't North come Carolina? down. Yeah, they don't come down off the mountains. All right. So I'm I, just I, saying, I, I, I lived up there. I'm not making fun. I'm just saying I lived up there. Interesting. Uh huh. Interesting. Well, um, <laughs> all right, when we come back, Jane Marie's going to reveal my what turn, my yes, turn. hers is. And I have a feeling she might be really messed up. <laughs> you think? Well, I can't be worse than Brandon. Mine's <laughs> 57. And he's got like a one, two, three, four, five, five mixes. But he looks pretty good. Five though. mixes. <laughs> All right, so we'll be back with you here on Southern. Sassy. <laughs> Eddie, you know, car sales have really changed over the last couple of years. Yeah, they have, Greg, but we're still getting the car that you want. If you're patient, you're willing to come in and give us a little bit of time, we're filling every order. And we still want your used cars. Go to NorthGeorgiaToyota.com to check your value. Greg, other dealers are going to say, we can't do that. What do we say? Oh, yes, they can. Hey, that's my part. <laughs> Only at North Georgia Toyota in Dalton. Come see us. If you could live anywhere, where would it be? What would it be like? With today's home values, this is the perfect time to sell and make those dreams a reality. At ColdwellBanker.com, you can get an instant estimate on your home. Your dreams don't have to be just dreams. At Coldwell Banker Canal Realty, we've been serving our community since 1974 with offices in Dalton, Calhoun, Ringgold, Cardsville, and Cleveland, Tennessee. We've got you covered. Hi, I'm Mitch Sanford with Biltwell Bank. Yes, that's right. First Bank of Dalton is now Biltwell Bank. What does that mean for you? It means the same exceptional service from the bankers you know and trust. It means a larger footprint that expands through 13 counties in Georgia and Tennessee. It means your community bank is still right around the corner. Want to learn more? Visit us at Biltwell.Bank or give us a call at 706-226-5377. Well-built communities start with well-built banks. Did you know skin cancer is the most common cancer in the United States with over 5 million cases diagnosed each year, yet it is one of the most preventable? Hi, I'm Courtney Johnston, the physician assistant at Dalton Plastic Surgery. 
Did you know we offer routine skin checks in our office? Schedule your appointment with us if you have any areas of concern or if you have not had a recent skin exam. At Dalton Plastic Surgery, we offer an array of different services to help you feel and look your very best. Give us a call today. Hey guys, and welcome back, Southern. Sassy. And today we are going to find out who the real Jamie Marie Wilson is. <laughs> <laughs> if you've wondered, we're going to reveal that today, yep. right? Maybe. 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 Are you a big mix like other people I know are? Yes. That's here. I have. I have. Show. I have. A, I have a little bit of a mix going on. Do you? But do you have more than I do? Because I only had two mixes. Yes, I do have more do? than you. Mm -hmm. Well, this is strange. Why has everybody got more than I got? I don't know. I maybe must be boring. Or maybe you're just not a big hybrid. Yeah, yeah I, guess. I guess not. But you know, uh, you, you think about DNAs are used in a lot of different. We talked about that <clears throat> a little in the first segment. But you know, with some of the shows, you don't know who the daddy is. They oh do yeah, a lot those of talk DNAs. shows. See if they're the baby daddy and all that. Yeah, who's your daddy? Well, and a lot of times they say, "Yeah, we can rule you out, but we can't say for sure." It's you, but we can for sure say we rule you out. By DNA? Uh-huh. I think it's the, uh, the percentages they get back, if they can do it or not. Oh. Um, you know, it depends on how heavy it is. Mm -hmm. Like 99.9% .9 sure that yeah. the probability is, yeah. the way they word it. Yeah. But I tell you, um, so I watched Cold like, cases? Yeah, I was going to say, me and my killing shows during, during COVID, I watched all these, you know, murder shows and stuff. And, you know, they'll do DNA now as routine, and they do all that to find, you know, yeah. the murderer or the killer or whatever. But what they've done is, like, they've saved all this evidence from these cases, like, 23 years ago, when DNA wasn't, you couldn't do DNA. Yeah. But they've saved it all, and now they're pulling them back out using the blood or whatever on it that they've preserved for all these years oh and tracking down killers who thought they'd gotten away with it like 30 years ago or whatever so all these cold case justice shows are coming on and stuff and that's really cool because they can use dna to go back and do that yeah that is interesting okay. all right you ready Big reveal yeah okay. i want to know who the real will the real right. jay marie wilson stand up all right you gonna <laughs> guess um <clears throat> i think for sure scotland no 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 scotland german no german Hmm. Cahutta. No, no <laughs> Cahutta. It's way, way, way far away from Cahutta. Uh, gee, I, um, um, <clears throat> um, England? No. Well, where are you from? <clears throat> Siberia. What? And Asia? No way. Scandinavia? Now, that I could see. And the British Isles. Really? Mm -hmm. What are the, what are the, uh, the, the heavy, percentage? heavy, heavy British Isles. Really? Um, heavy British Isles in Scandinavia. Asia and Siberia are, are minute. What is your Asian? Um, 1%. I wouldn't have thought Asia. I don't know, but I've got like this olive skin tone I got from my dad. Uh -huh. So maybe that's part of it because, you know, um, <clears throat> Asians have like an olive skin tone where they take yeah. the sun really well. Right. Now, growing up, I never really sunburned. I think my skin would absorb it. But yeah, the Siberia, not real sure where that came from. That is interesting. I sent it to my sister, and I'm like, hmm. And she's like, Siberia? Where, where are we from Siberia? That wasn't in the book. We have a book, which I didn't know until oh, I... Oh, my God. I had I, one. Did you have I, one? I forgot to bring it. Because yeah. they, um, they did it. I remember growing up, we had it. It was called Macmillan and Allied Families or whatever. And I didn't really know what it was because I was little. But my mom would show me. It had my name in there. And it was somebody that had done our family tree right. way back before computers and DNA. And it was a book. And it said, you know, my mom and dad's name and, you know, where they were from. And their right. parents, their parents, parents, all the way back. And then we were in there as the children. And it was really cool. I wonder if they I still don't have that book. That's I don't know neat. that people do that now. Do you? I don't know either because everything's online and immediate. Like we've done this and we sent it off and we got our results back. And they don't really do anything. Like you said, no, you didn't want to follow up on it. No. But used to it was a research thing and you'd go to the library and you'd pull the books. You could see the handwriting and you could research it. And you kind of pursue stories from older people and you get draft cards and all that. And I think it was more fun back then because it was more hands on. I'm going to look at yours again. I know. I cannot believe it's Scandinavian. That is unreal. 
Yeah, Siberia. the Siberian thing threw me off. And I'm what like, else that's did it say really about you? Crazy. Did you go into any of these? But see, I, mine is all diet traits. It, it told me like how I metabolize gluten and how I metabolize alcohol and stress eating and, and caffeine metabolism. I'm a fast caffeine metabolizer. Uh, wow. I'm more likely to have a gluten sensitivity. My carbohydrates, I'm more likely to become overweight. See, mine didn't have like the ancestry stuff. Mine's Vitagene, so mine did more like uh, genes for your triglyceride and your cholesterol see, levels. I wish mine had had Mine's this. more of a health like thing. It told me where I was from, but this is more of a health thing. Yeah. So you just told you a lot more because I about think, my body. Yeah. And my, me personally, rather than generic. Yeah. Mine was all generic, but you know what? Genetic. I mean, not well, generic. Well, generic, genetic. Well. Yes, but if you pursued the family tree and people that had your genes, then you could have gone on and, and done more. Yeah. Because, see, this is genetically, like the alcohol, each one they would elaborate on things like this. So it's like drink in moderation because genetically you're 50% uh, mostly influenced by genetics. And you're more likely you can drink more moderately than others and you won't have extreme flushing or hangovers. And then it went on to talk <laughs> about... <laughs> Ah, you, you jealous are, of me? You won't have any hangovers. <laughs> but then, but it did each one. It tells you which gene it was and the That's allele and by the genotype. Um, and it would tell you. I'm going to do another one. Yeah, and then it would go through like, like the weight gain and metabolism of yeah. cholesterol and stuff like that. So it was. I'm going to do was, another one. I'm going to do this one. And see, see if I, I would come like back. yours because well, let's I, trade. Yeah, I was going to say it. See how it would come back. I wonder because I wonder across testing, you know, how it compares. I wonder if you see we could still be sisters if you come back with this one. If I come back Scan Scandinavian, would it be a way to check them? <laughs> you Let's know? do another one. I know. I think because we <clears throat> I'm just wondering if it really would come back the same. Yeah. Although Brandon said that his changes. It updated, yeah, updated. So it could be. Yeah. So I'm but, just curious. <clears throat> but mine was like a whole different thing because mine was more genetically personal to me and you yours and Brandon's were more of your ancestry yeah your ancestors yeah, yours your genetic ancestry personal. and mine was more my body and what my body will so do so you can really purchase different kinds yeah uh, that's what I'm saying I don't know all yeah. the differences there's so many different kinds interesting interesting yeah. so, well anyway. I, I have enjoyed this as far as finding out who you really it's been are kind of fun. you sure that's who you are that's what it said <laughs> I don't know if I'm sure but that's what it Who's said your daddy <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to have to go on a talk show. Hey, who's your daddy? Who's your daddy? Okay. All right. We got to run, guys. We'll see you next time again on Southern Sassy. your business on TV, contact Elliott Media at 706-529-4237.